a great day ahead to the people around. I'm Kuila Shini, daughter of Mahendra, a semester 5 student at Polytechnic Ibrahim Sultan. I study in Diploma in Mechanical Engineering Material. For the few past decades, industries has evolved and progressed rapidly. The 9th Malaysian Plan was drawn in response to the current global needs to enable Malaysia to stay competitive in the world market. Department of Polytechnic Education DPE, constantly collaborates with major industry players in the country in developing the respective curriculum. One of the most important factors driving the growth of productivity is by having a qualified and talented manpower in order for the industry to develop and remain competitive in the world market. The activities of many industries require increasingly competent technicians in engineering field, particularly in mechanical engineering. As a part of the new educational reform, Technical and Vocational Education and Training TVET system is undergoing a fine-tuning in order to make it a credible alternative to general education. The introduction of the CBT in TVET reform will therefore engage most youths in the country in effective structured skills, development and workplace experience to ensure employment opportunities and industry-led skills development. In response to these issues, Curriculum Development and Evaluation Division of the Department of Polytechnic Education has developed and introduced Diploma in Mechanical Engineering for Polytechnic. This program aims to prepare students with necessary knowledge, skills and abilities in the mechanical engineering industries in ensuring the curriculum content fulfills the industrial requirements Several key players from related industries have been involved in the curriculum development process. Polytechnic Ibrahim Sultan provides some diploma holder program in mechanical engineering, mechanical engineering material, mechanical engineering manufacturing, mechatronic engineering, and advanced diploma in mechatronics engineering. The curriculum is developed to give balanced emphasis on theoretical and practical aspects. The programs will take six semesters to complete, relatively three academic semesters at their respective polytechnics and one semester of industrial training at the relevant industries during fourth semester. Students are required to return to their respective institution for the completion of the program in the fifth and sixth semester. Quality of programs under Malaysian Qualification Agency Standards, MQA. Now, I'm going to explain a bit further regarding the causes. First is Diploma in Mechanical Engineering. Diploma in Mechanical Engineering at Polytechnics Ministry of Higher Education Malaysia is designed to cover the current wide discipline of mechanical engineering with added specialization subjects in the field of mechanical engineering. Second course is Diploma in Mechanical Engineering Material. Diploma in Mechanical Engineering Material is designed to cover the current wide discipline of mechanical engineering with added specialization in the area of material. Next is Diploma in Mechanical Engineering Manufacturing. Diploma in Mechanical Engineering Manufacturing is designed to cover the current wide discipline of mechanical engineering with added specialization in the area of manufacturing, design, manufacturing economy, instrumentation and control, and industrial maintenance. Other than that is Diploma in Mechatronics Engineering. Diploma in Mechatronics Engineering at Polytechnics Ministry of Higher Education Malaysia is designed to cover the current wide discipline of mechatronics engineering with added specialization subjects in the field of mechatronics engineering. Finally, is Advanced Diploma in Mechatronics Engineering. Advanced Diploma in Mechatronics Engineering is a specific qualification which identifies an individual who has knowledge, technical skills, managerial abilities, and more complex and higher responsibilities than those expected at the diploma level. Several key players from the related industries have been involved in the curriculum development process to ensure the curriculum content fulfills the industrial requirement. The program takes three semesters to complete. Advanced Diploma Mechatronic Engineering is designed to cover the current wide discipline of mechatronic engineering with the emphasis on automotion, used in the field of mechatronics engineering. Program Learning Outcomes PLO for the completion of the program to ensure graduates should be able to first able to apply the knowledge of mathematics, science and engineering fundamentals 
to well-defined mechatronics engineering procedures and practices. Next, is able to demonstrate practical skills which includes the ability to troubleshoot, repair and do maintenance work for mechatronics equipment specialized in material engineering. Other than that, able to communicate effectively with the engineering community and the society at large. Next, is able to apply creative and critical thinking in solving problems to assign tasks. Graduates should be able to demonstrate awareness and consideration for societal and health, also safety, legal and cultural issues and the consequent responsibilities taking into the account the need of sustainable development. Furthermore, graduates should be able to recognize the need of professional development and engage in independent acquisition of new knowledge and skill. Other than that, they are also able to recognize the need for entrepreneurship. Next, they should be able to demonstrate an understanding of professional ethics, responsibilities and norms of mechatronics engineering. Finally, they could function individually or in teams effectively with the capabilities to be a leader. Now, I am going to share with you the job prospects. All the programs in Mechanical Engineering, Polytechnic Ibrahim Sultan provides the knowledge and skills to be applied in a broad range of mechanical engineering careers. The knowledge and skills that the students acquire from the program will enable them to participate in the job market as Technical Assistant, Assistant Service Manager, Service Advisor, Supervisor, Assistant Engineer, Junior Engineer, Technical Instructor or Lecturer, Technical Sales Executive. The job market for the graduates of Diploma in Mechanical Engineering Material are Assistant Quality Control, QA and Quality Assurance, Assistant Researcher and Developer for Government Agencies, Research Centres and Private Laboratories, Assistant Engineer, Assistant Designer, Assistant Material Selector, Assistant or Technician for Material Laboratory, Destructive Testing DT and Non-Destructive Testing NDT Laboratory Assistants, Metal Casting Technician, Assistant Analyzer for the Metal Properties and Defect, Processing, Manufacturing and Production Technician in the Metal and Non-Metal Field, especially for Iron and Steel Materials, Plastic Materials, Ceramics, Glasses and Composites, Testing Equipment Salesman and Material Inspector, also other careers related. Meanwhile, these are the job market for graduates of Diploma in Mechanical Engineering Manufacturing, which are Production or Process Planner, Procurement Executive, Quality Officer, CNC Programmer, Product Designer, Technical Specialist, Process Supervisor, Technical Assistant, Draughtsman, and Precision Machinist. Besides that, for Mechatronics Engineering graduates, the, the job market are Assistant Engineering Electrical, Automotion and Robotic, Technical Designer, Technical Assistant, Assistant Electronic Engineer, Control System Supervisor, Automotion and Robotic Supervisor, and Mechanical and Electrical System Designer. Finally, job markets such as Production Technician, Test and Reliability Technician, Maintenance Engineer, Application Engineer, Controller System Supervisor, Automotion and Robotic Supervisor, and Mechanical and Electrical System Designer are the job market for the graduates of Advanced Diploma in Mechatronics Engineering. As a conclusion, I would like to mention that the graduates in Polytechnics will have the knowledge, technical skills, soft skills and attitude to adapt themselves with new technological challenges in the mechanical engineering field. That's all from me. I thank you for spending your precious time in listening what I was saying. Thank you very much. Have a pleasant day ahead.